time I glue on the back side of it. I do want to take this strike it like this. Of course, I will be double checking things before I put glue on them. I want to double check. Lay it down like this and you will need something for the glue to drip on. This guy will go like that. And this one doesn't require too much glue. But it's a piece that's gonna stand here like this. Okay. Most people will put a bunch of nails. We'll put drive nails here in the middle, push it in. So it will take the form of your existing staircase, which is all bowed. So I don't like doing that, obviously. So since the riser sits here, I can hide a couple nails right underneath it. Okay. And so, all I want to do, really, and of course you do want to check this, you want to make sure that it all fits properly. So you can use inch and a half, for this I use one inch. Chances of them bending and coming out the other side are smaller this way so right there and I don't put anything here I do put one at the angle like this another one at the angle right here I don't put anything here because I don't want it to take the shape again this old Staircase have been sagging for 80 years. Yes, I hear you. I don't care. I'm, I'm working. The reason I use subfloor liquid nails, subfloor and deck, is because when you get it on your products, it's easy to remove it with just these gloves. Okay. And now I'm not gonna put anything there. The glue will catch it. And then I'm just gonna drive one or two right in the corner somewhere. And try to drive it into that. Like this. And don't drive anything here. See the gap? You don't wanna push all that stuff in there. Just want it to catch. side I'm doing this and I know nobody's gonna walk on them for 24 hours if you do have traffic or anticipating traffic you should definitely put more half inch 
overhang. It's gonna hide my nails. So I'm just gonna put one here, a little on the angle down. Like this. Make sure it's down all the way. There. And nothing here in the middle. I'm gonna show you how to do without nailing through these guys because they're shiny and sleek so these holes in these surface will be showing you'll see them so instead Now I'm just gonna put glue everywhere, like this, like that, okay, so I do waves, okay. or triangles, and I do want to make sure I got glue on this piece as well, so now when I'm gonna put it in, it's gonna just glue this whole thing together. And what's gonna be holding it all together is glue, not those nails. And I'm just gonna take it together. See if I need any more. It's pretty good. Let's. I'll do another one. Just in case. Pull it. And glue it. Together. And one more. Now I wanna make sure that it's not lifting. Right? this time but I'm just gonna show you so sometimes you do have to just like that then you don't want to step on a stair nose like this you want to step right here so I'm gonna do that step on a flat part go up if you need to Hey, what do you know? All the gaps are gone. Where did they go? Hey. Hello. Well, some of them are still dry. Like this one is still dry in there, but it's all. I mean, if you don't crawl on all four, you put your eyes in there. Looks. Pretty good. What do you think? Thank you.